All right, it's time to check out episode 15 of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Last we saw, Jura King Bradley is Wrath, one of the seven deadly... What the fuck? Somebody asked if I recognize the beard of a uh, father. Yes, it looks like his dad's, Ed's and Al's dad's beard. I assume that's him, for some reason, insanely old now. All right, let's get to it. Silver Alchemist to battle, do you? You've got guts, I'll give you that. Forgot about stuff. Just like the Monopoly guy. Nice move. Bad, not bad at all. You got off with just a scratch. Oh, he got him. You can't say the same. <laughs> I thought he was gonna let her drown. So was that like the first arc? The last one definitely felt like a finale. That was fantastic. The tattoo that I bear is a result of that research. <gasps> That's incredible. Your brother must have really been something. I'm not really sure what you two are talking about, but your wound is healed now, sir. We can be on our way to Central without any further delay. Oh, that sounds great! I'll go get my things. What do you think you're doing? Excuse me, Mama. That's why I have to find him. The incredible man I've heard so much about. They say his hair and his eyes are golden like the sun. He wears a dashing red coat as he strides forth to save people in need. Oh. You never know when you might meet the terrible serial killer feared by all. Bury the chocolate! Oh, shit! <laughs> Don't bear what you have to pull a gun for! Oh, shit! <laughs> all right, that's it, lady. Now I'm gonna hear you scream! <laughs> that's Mustang's right hand, right? <laughs> what are you doing showing up like this? <laughs> <laughs> Even Kamenia is holding down an honest job now, and you two still can't. <laughs> or something? Uh, well, no. <laughs> I feel so much better. You guys are lifesavers. Thanks a lot. Your treat, right? When did I say I was paid? Let's not quibble over something so small. <laughs> How lucky I am to have found such hospitality! So far from home! <laughs> far from home? You mean you're not from here? That's right! I came from Sheen! I see a hand on his uh, thing. Or nothing. Yeah, sorry, but I'm not actually an alkahistrist. <laughs> if you don't practice alkahistry, why well, come all the way here to research it? Well, see, I'm looking for something. It's possible you two have heard of it before. The Philosopher's Stone. I'm very eager to find it. Do you know anything about it? No, we can't help you. Hmm. You wouldn't be lying to me now, would you? Oh, shit! So immortality. Full Metal Alchemist. Gotcha, okay. Full Metal Alchemist. Out with it, what do you know? Immortality, please. What a bunch of nonsense. Not to me, it isn't. In any case, I can't say that I care too much for your way of asking questions. Kind of rude, don't you think? Go ahead, man. Shit. Jeez. Is that guy an acrobat? Must be a Shinyi's fighting style. Could be tough to beat. <laughs> Even so, they're still not as strong. Ask teacher! <laughs> What's happening down there? <laughs> Off they go. Hmm. Hey, Pops, let's add some dessert to my tab. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> 
This nigga. It's a nice move. You're persistent, picking a fight like this just because I won't give you information? What are you guys after? You and your boss with the freaky closed eyes. Wow. You try to hey, fucking- I landed one! If this is the best his flunkies can manage, that bastard Ling must be pretty pathetic too! Just like before. As soon as I insult his boss, this guy completely loses his cool. Yeah. When that happens, his attacks become weak and useless. Now then, I think it's about time for me to have a look at your face. Oh, oh shit. God. She has a cannon in her prosthetic. This country is a place to be reckoned with. Hmm? What? Hey! Hmm. Not too bad, considering it was my first time. It's Alcatraz Street. <laughs> Alphonse is a beast. I overdid it. Look at this place. Master Lee will be furious. Sorry, I know I understand much language of this country. Okay, bye bye now. <laughs> 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 you ran away. Yeah, that too. You gotta be kidding. Back me without a transmutation circle now? Yeah, I think it's because of the memories I recovered. Right. And that means. <laughs> 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 Stone isn't a tool for some political game. Oh, then I'll have to stay with you until you tell me. No, no, you don't get off of me. Did you see that? There was some kind of fight on Main Street, so it took a while to. <laughs> what? Ishvalan names are sacred. Ishvalan people take great pride in speaking their names aloud, as they are gifts from God. Well then, sir, your name must be a special one indeed. I have renounced my Ishvalan name. Now go! Keep moving! Uh, right! I am walking down a path of no return. So I will leave behind me every gift I have received from God. Scar is a walking Let savage. That was episode 15 of Full Metal Alchemist. Definitely a um, bit of a break, kind of a come down after the last episode. Uh, and we had to introduce some new characters. Again, you know me. It's going to take me quite a while to get anybody down. Um, but there is the Emperor's son and his two henchmen slash women, we'll call them. So, henchman and henchwoman. Um... Uh, the girl, who I assume was traveling with the Emperor, um, and is now with Scar. All things to say, I thought it was an enjoyable episode. I enjoyed the fight very much so. Um, Scar is always fun, even in his limited role. And these new characters, I think, are going to be decent enough. Uh, the Emperor's son is a douche, but he's, he looks like he could be hilarious. I'm not sure how I feel about the little girl with Scar. Her voice. Her voice is slightly off-putting to me. There's something off about it. The grown woman's voice. Like, Al sounds like a kid. This little girl sounds like a grown-up putting on a little kid's voice. Does that make any sense at all? Whenever somebody mentions the Philosopher's Stone now, I just get super nervous. Not because I'm afraid they might do something about it, but I'm just concerned about Fucking Fuhrer, King Brown. I just nervous. He makes me nervous now. Like, I don't look like, up. But they need him. He's gonna. They gotta sacrifice Ed and Al, or Ed, Ed rather. So 
I guess he's safe for the moment. Anyhow, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe.